Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have some cleaning motivation for you. These are just some clips of cleaning that I did over a few days. And then at the end of this video, I'm gonna talk to you guys about a new nail polish kit thing that I've been trying out and I'm actually really excited about. But first I'm in the bathroom, starting out with cleaning the tub. I've had some people say they've never seen me clean the tub before. And maybe that's true because I probably don't do it often enough. I also don't normally record it when I do it because the bathroom is so small and it's so hard to get like a good angle with the camera so excuse the angles of me cleaning the tub right now like there's really nowhere for me to put the camera it's so awkward but yeah i definitely don't clean the tub as often as i probably should but i should be getting better at that pretty soon because we have a new shower head that we're going to be putting in and it's one of those that has like the handle that you can pull down and kind of like rinse all around the tub and I think that will just make it so much easier especially like rinsing the tub so hopefully that will motivate me a little bit more to clean the tub more often but anyway I am just using well normally I would use soft scrub with bleach on the tub but I ended up running out of that I don't know how that happened but I ran out so I'm just using the CLR kitchen and bath kitchen and bath cleaner and a scrub brush and excuse my clothes in this part too. You'll see there's like paint all over my clothes because these are my painting clothes. I was working on painting the front door on this day and for a couple days actually I was working on it. Um, but you'll see the door finished in a little bit. This California weather, it's like 90 degrees It's making me hot and he has the same effect on me It's just something about the way that he's making me feel My insides are out, I just wanna shout The sink needed to be cleaned too, so since I had all my cleaning stuff out I just decided to do that also I use Lime Away for the hard water buildup on the faucet And then the CLR for the rest of the sink oh, My body's giving up on me I don't know what to do with my fingertips ah, I wanna run him through his hair But I'm trying not to stare mm -mm. I get a little starstruck when I see him I couldn't hate him even if I tried Am I a little crazy to believe that I could wake up with him by my side I know I could get his attention if I worked it all out And we got a little tipsy on a Saturday night And I want him and I need him He's got a one way Shaking from the urge of being with him I act a little dumber when I try to get his number I'm so nervous that I'm losing grip of myself Ah, my body's giving up on me Cause I don't know what to do with my fingertips Ah, I wanna run Here I'm cleaning the stove top And this is something I really don't like to do If you've been watching my videos for a while You know I always mention this I hate cleaning the stove top I let that go for way too long um, but I did pick up one of these Scrub Daddy sponges. I've never had one before, but I've seen a few different people using them. I thought it looked cool, so I picked one up at Target, I think. Um, and it's pretty nifty, and it has made cleaning the stovetop a little bit more fun. I don't know, I don't know. Sometimes just getting a little new cleaning tool, cleaning gadget, just motivates you a little bit more. So, definitely motivated me. So, yeah, cleaning the stove today. I wanna run him through his hair, but don't stare. Get a little starstruck when I see him I couldn't hit him even if I tried Making me hot and he has the same effect on me. I act a little dumb. Next, I'm just going to vacuum the living room. So first I just pick up everything off the floor, 
and brush any crumbs off of the couch onto the floor so I can vacuum those up too. Um, this couch cover is a new thing for us. My dog, Gracie, you may have seen her in videos here and there. Um, she's 12 now and she has been having some more frequent pee pee accidents in the house and a lot of time, a lot of the time it's on the couch. And I just got, it was to the point where I was like, I need to do something. I can't keep having her, like having her pee on the couch and then having to clean it. It's so hard to clean like that urine smell out of like fabric and stuff. So I was like, I need to do something. So I went on Amazon and I found the couch cover and it's been great if she has an accident, it kind of like beads up on the fabric. She actually did pee on the couch like the second day after I had, the second day after I put the cover on, she had an accident on the couch and it just kind of beaded up on there and I took the whole thing off threw it in the wash and so easy. You might also notice that I'm using my regular corded vacuum in here instead of my cordless anti-hair wrap roller one that I got not too long ago, the new one that I got. That's because I feel like this vacuum does a better job, especially on the rugs. I think the suction power and combo with the regular brush roller just works better. I was finding that whenever I use the anti-hair wrap roller, like that come, that came on the cordless vacuum, I was still finding hairs on the rug like after I vacuumed and I was not okay with that. So uh, yeah, I'm sticking with this one for all of my regular vacuuming and the cordless one I just keep in the kitchen and I use it for like picking up crumbs and stuff and that's pretty much it. Now into the boys room, I just had a little bit of dusting to do and I had to change Noah's crib sheet and I did order him a twin bed and it's the same one as Chase's so pretty soon they'll have matching big boy beds, so I'm excited for that. It'll be cute. wanted to clean the storm door from all the kids smudges and spit they literally licked the door like their tongues touched the door I know I'm not the, I know I'm not the only one whose kids lick the door but yeah there's like spit and finger smudges on the door so I just had to clean that all off especially since I just painted it I had to get the, the glass all clean I don't know if you guys can see this, but can you see the dirt on here? Just from the kids like touching the white trim when they're going in and out. It's just so dirty. I just noticed that. The magic eraser, ew. Even this is dirty. Oh, that looks so much nicer. I don't think this is gonna come off, but we'll see. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it does come off. I thought that was just like discolored from being an old door. That's crazy. so much better. Oh my goodness. Get 
believe I didn't clean that yet. That's gonna be it for the cleaning part of this video, but before I go, I wanna show you guys something that I'm actually pretty excited about, and maybe some of you guys will be interested in it too. It's gel nail polish, and I know absolutely nothing about gel nail polish. Um, I'm just learning about it now, but I do know that it's supposed to be stronger and like last longer than regular nail polish, which is awesome because I used to paint my nails all the time before I had kids. Like I had so many colors and I just like to switch it up for holidays and seasons and I really liked nail polish. But then after I had kids and I was just like using my hands so much during the day, like it would chip so easily. I did find one nail polish that would give me about three days before chipping and that was the best I ever found. Um, but even with three days before chipping, it just feels like I've put so much work into it and time like trying to make my nails look nice and then it would just chip right away but a company that makes gel nail polishes reached out to me and wanted to see if i would be interested in trying them and sharing them with you guys what i thought of it and the company is called nail addict you might have heard of them before or maybe not um but they let me pick six six yeah six nail polishes um and they sent me a little like uv lamp i'm going to show you guys what i got here so they let me pick six colors um i picked the well I, I asked for the top coat and the base coat so i got this is just the base coat and this is the top coat and i did want to pick these because i wanted to make sure that i was using like the right products for this nail polish to give it the best chance of like staying and like lasting the longest um and then they let me pick four other colors but they sent me an extra one i think because one of the colors i picked they didn't have in stock so they were just being nice and like threw in an extra one um but these are the ones that i got well first let me show you my nails so i did it for the first time let me get some lighting good lighting here i did it for the first time yesterday so this is day two so far there is no chipping i have to practice a little bit because the polish is like a little bit thicker than like regular nail polish and I did notice that you can see on that nail a little bit where like the color kind of like came off and I think maybe it wasn't cured all the way or something before I put the next coat on. So it's going to be a little bit of a learning process, but so far it looks really good and there's no chipping anywhere. And the nail polish is like hard, like it's solid on there, but let me show you the colors up close. I wanted to go with some fall colors, so I got this one is called Diva. And that's what that looks like. It's like a deep uh, burgundy reddish color, which I really like for fall. This is the one that I have on my nails right now. It's called Candy. It's like a light purpley color. Hot Date is that one. I think that was one that they just sent me because another color I picked they didn't have. This one I was really excited to get. Uh, it's called Do Me A Favor. It's just like a really light pinky neutral color. I'm excited to try that one. And then this one is called Pink Panther, and this one they sent me too because the other color was, they didn't have it, but it looks like that. And then this is the little mini UV LED lamp that they give me, and it comes with a cord to plug it in. You could plug it into your computer, or you can just plug it into like a, a thing that uses that, whatever that's called. But so far, I really, really like these. Like I said, I think there's like a learning curve to this. I have, I noticed that I have to make sure not to get any on my skin because it's not like reg regular nail polish where the bits that you get on your skin will kind of just like peel off and like fall away. This I noticed will like peel off, but it'll just continue peeling onto your nail, like peeling off of your nail. Um, so what I had to do was take like these clippers and kind of like cut off the extra that was on my skin so that it wouldn't peel off of my nails. Um, but I'm hoping that this will last longer than three days like if it can go like five days that would be amazing and i would totally be back to painting my nails because you want it to last you know and if i'm gonna spend the time painting my nails and you know take time out of the night to let them dry and, and be really careful about it you know i want it to last like longer than two or three days so yeah if you guys find yourself in the same boat like you used to like to paint your nails but now you really don't because you're a mom and you're like using your hands all day long and it always chips on you Maybe you want to give Nail Addict a try. And I have an awesome discount code for you guys. It's 45% off. It might actually even be 50% off right now because they were upgrading the, uh, the coupon code. But I will leave that on the screen, that you can the code that you can use when you order, um, and in the description as well. So, yeah, I'm really excited about these. I'm going to try, like, all my different colors, and I'll probably end up getting, like, some more colors for, like, spring and summer because right now I just have, like, the fall colors. But, but yeah, that's going to be it for this video. 
I hope you guys enjoyed a little cleaning motivation and yeah, I'll see you guys all in my next one. Bye.